Hello Leander ISD. School starts tomorrow and we're so excited to welcome our students back in person. I want to start by referencing our core beliefs. Each and every student is at the heart of our decisions. This requires a focus on students and all elements that impact their overall student experience in order for them to reach their maximum potential. And the third one says, our Ally ISD family thrives when we ensure a welcoming, safe and caring environment in which we treat one another with integrity, respect, fairness and acceptance while appreciating our differences. We find ourselves in exceptionally difficult times. We have differences of opinion about what we should and shouldn't do to ensure the safety of each individual in our family. We know that the governor of the state of Texas has given individuals the choice of whether to wear a mask or not. At Leander ISD, we strongly encourage everyone to wear a mask to keep our entire family safe. Because individuals have a choice to wear a mask or not, we believe as a district that individuals should also have a choice to be in person or remote in order to keep their family safe. And so we're doing everything in our power to make sure that you have that option to choose remote if that's what you need for your family. We will be asking our board to support us financially to make sure that we can provide remote learning for those families who choose it. We continue to advocate as a district for the remote learning option and for the state to fund that option. And so I was at the legislature testifying in front of the Senate Education Committee this week for that very reason. As we work towards providing remote instruction for anyone who chooses it, our team has done an incredibly heavy lift over the last several days to make that happen. Both the central office team and especially our principals have worked long, hard hours to make sure that every child has what they need. Even said, there are going to be some bumps in this road and not everything is going to be perfect for every child as we go through this year. We hope you will continue to exercise patience and grace with us as we progress through this work. I'm extremely grateful for the support that the board has provided to us as we work through these difficult changes. And we look forward to continuing to work with the team of eight as we find solutions to these very challenging problems. Masks are very effective in this environment. Please stay home if you're sick. Wash your hands and sanitize as often as you can. And please be kind. Please show grace. Together, we can get through these challenges. Thank you, and I look forward to seeing you in person very soon.